Jody Hills is one of the gifted authors that we work with here at Tristan Publishing. When I first read the manuscript, I knew it had power. There it was, her whole life, or at least this size of it, spread out before her. She had fallen in love in that jacket and was kissed at the coffee shop wearing those jeans. Nothing held a grudge like that orange sweater or clung to bitter memories like that patterned scarf. When I first started writing, I always think I must be the only person thinking and feeling this way. But it turns out um, that everyone is living these lives and doing these things. It's this constant decision every morning. What am I going to wear and what am I going to look like and what am I going to do? And we all go through that. And so this metaphor for our lives, how are we going to look, how are we going to feel, it all gets intertwined. Her heart would fit her wardrobe and was much more reliable than one size fits most. She knew there would be some danger wearing it so close to the surface, but it went with everything she had, and it made her feel beautiful. My mother taught me that, how to live and be okay and be okay from the inside out, and it was so frightening to think, you know, do you love someone that much that you could lose them? But she taught me it was okay and you would survive. She had nice things. She had a lot of nice things. The problem was they were so entangled with everything else, everything else that she didn't wear anymore, but she couldn't let go of. Designer labels of fear, worry, hurt, and stagnation. Why were these bits of material so hard to let go of? Jody uses clothing and a wardrobe to really show us that there are certain things in life we really want to hold on to, and some things we really ought to just let go of. Just like her metaphor, looking at the cloth and clothing and fabric, and bringing that into our emotions and, and experiences. This book has a way of doing that. It's like the song you pick on the radio. It's the food that you eat. It's what you're feeling and doing. You can change your mood by what you put on, or what you put on can change your mood. Jody did some great work. I've never seen her art look more beautiful than it does in that book. It was the first one I did for the book because I knew I needed this person who was just so free and open and loose and, and you knew that she felt beautiful just in what she was wearing. You could see it, you could see it in her movement. Every person that looks at it sees themselves in a different page. So many of the sayings really are, are things that people can resonate with. It is the metaphor for life. You don't cling to the old. You go to what's new and, and, and find what's new in both your heart and your wardrobe and put those together and it'll be beautiful. We know that when people look to buy a Tristan Publishing title, there's some expectation with that. Jody's special gift is to have the insight to make the most heartfelt and powerful thoughts come out in a very simple way. After cleaning and still believing you are what you wear, she placed her heart on her sleeve and knew she would be fabulous.